Hello there. How Hi are guys. You? How are you? Hello. Kia ora. Kia ora. <laughs> yeah. Everything is um, stone and it's all geothermal. So we've actually um, we've been very conscious of, um, of doing it a bit for the environment. So really? all the stones from the Himalayas, yes. Wow. Three container loads. My wife was determined to have a quarter acre because she's a great gardener. And so this is her creation outside. I'm just the barrow boy outside here. Yeah. So we had our first night here on Saturday. Did you? Yeah. Wow. It's, a, it's a great outlook and it's very nice. And I bought a little table and chairs to sit on the back. On the balcony. <laughs> Who lives in this house here? Who's in your family? Well, it's just me and um, my beloved husband, Rob Davidson, otherwise known as Robbie. <laughs> this is Susie, my, my partner, my wife. We actually met in 1990 in the Gulf War in Jordan. Uh, my wife, Bronnie, so she's made herself unavailable for this today. We've got um, pita bread for lunch and uh, we're going to collect some uh, bit of asparagus and some microgreens from outside and some rocket to make a wee salad and we're going to have um, stuffed pita bread with you know nice things. We're having a, a vegan beer uh, loaf and uh, it, it, it's basic, it's flour, baking powder, brown sugar, salt and beer. So it's not complicated and it's, uh, it's damn tasty. So are you, going to, are you going to be cooking dinner here, Leanne? No, it's uh, China National Day, so I've already been to a special event tonight and uh, on my way home, and uh, we're going out for uh, dinner with some Chinese friends tonight. What motivates you? Why do you bother? Seeing whether um, problems can be solved. You know, I, I enjoy taking on challenges, and um, I like people, so... I guess that's what motivates me. But it's not a job, it's a, it is a calling and it's an absolute privilege to serve. I'm doing it because so much needs to be done in the city. And when I looked around our east and parts of the city that I haven't seen, I was aghast at how it still looked like little Bosnia sometimes. And we're talking nine years on. It's just unacceptable. And so I said, no, I'll give it a shot. Our society is so unjust. I mean, the rich in New Zealand don't pay tax. So the poorest people in the country pay the highest proportion of their income in tax. Things like that, you know, the structure of our society is quite wrong. What's Minto? Is that a... It's Scottish. Scottish name, yeah. It came from the lowlands in Scotland, not far from the, from the English border. You're a Scot? Yeah, no, my granddad on my father's side. One family um, from Glasgow, the other one from Troon. Put the brown sugar in and mix it. Oh, I love having a wife. I call it checks and measures. Obama. Well, I've met President Obama, so um, I'll go with Obama. Trump. Yes, because there is a crisis. Yes. No. Yes. Uh, I think if you look at the inner city, it's, it's still, a lot of it's like a wasteland. And we're nine years after the earthquakes. Yes. Not really. It's, it's not failing. It's, it's still a work in progress. How's that? Definitely yes. Yes. Uh, wait, 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 wait. As a multi-use arena, thank you. No. No, just the rate of inflation. I'm afraid the answer is yes. No. No need, no need. A review before appraising the ability to sell. No. No. Absolutely yes. Well, it would be really good if I were an ECAN counsellor, because then I could tell you that I could actually deliver it. Um, yes. I think I am, yes. Oh, I like the Rebecca West phrase, which is, um, I'm called a feminist every time I, you know, sort of indicate I have views that distinguish me from a doormat. <laughs> <laughs> Not looking too bad. Not looking too bad, people.